Hey there, fuckers. Welcome to Waiting Till Midnight. We want to see who wants to meet us here and why. Or who's supposed to be meeting who here and why. It's almost midnight. I don't see anyone. Dab, fucking expert. Nice. Right, it's past midnight. Person should be here by now. I guess, I mean, who knows what they meant tonight, or what they meant, but I'll wait a little bit. But it was meant for a different night. They're not trapped behind the building. Huh. It's midnight 30 and there still isn't anyone here. Hell. I don't think anyone's coming. I don't think it's gonna happen. I think we just got jipped. Um, Alright, well, I guess let's go. We have a mission to complete. some other time. But I want to go to that stone real quick, get its power. So. Priority number one. Kind of the ambient sounds are really, I mean, they're pretty creepy if you ask me. On a scale of 1 to 10, then at 10, I forgot to start the timer. Let's see. So, I'll see, this episode might run a little bit longer, since we were just kind of sitting around for a little while. Fuck, not another one. Fucking asshole. Well, I'm ass, but I hit him. in my bones. Fuck. Sometimes I feel like the arrows just veer wildly off course. Or, you know, that happens. Got him. Hi. Thanks. Alright. 
Got a nice little bridge here. Well, not so much. Hup. Made it. I was actually a little afraid there that we weren't going to. Yeah, the stone's coming up here. Which is why we're here. Or why we're walking this way, I should say. Fortress right there. I'm good for it. Alright. Let's just discover this fortress quick. Just for the sake of having it as a fast travel point. More way to need it. Okay, bye. And goodbye. Alright, let's get to that stone. We'll go for a little jog to get there. Please don't walk in front of me when I'm trying to kill the thing. Thank you. Big temple bitch. I don't know why I'm punching, but... Oh god, that took a little bit out. That hurt us a little bit. Peace. Bitch. Oh, fuck. Wait, um. Well, fucking hell. <laughs> I just died. Oh, good God. You know, I fail sometimes. Do I even have a ring on? Ring of stamina, alright. I guess that that makes sense. Captain promised me a life of adventure on the high seas. Instead, I'm stuck on this cesspit of an island. I should go back to picking Island. pockets in Windhelm. Easy money. Yes, sir. Aren't these guys like all bandits? Just one more bottle. Sunstone. See what that power is. Sun flare. Oh, okay. To get to sleep. Told him to just hand it over, but did he listen? Oh, no. Alright. Well. That's a big mushroom. He might be at the big mushroom. To the big mushroom. Oh, well, there's a door in that mushroom. Well, god damn it. There's doors in all these mushrooms. There's fucking mushroom doors everywhere. Excuse me. Hello. I don't think you belong here. Uh -huh. Yes, I'm trying to summon an Ash Guardian. Just having trouble deciphering Master Neloth's handwriting. I, I don't mean to be rude, but I need to concentrate. Why are you out here? Oh, God. Aren't you supposed to be in the tower assisting us? Why won't the summoning work? We don't get many visitors. Is if there you something you know, need? I'm trying mm -hmm. to get this Ash Guardian spell to work. Now let me concentrate. Besides, shouldn't you be worrying about the damage to the tower? Master Nelloth has tasked Alenia with repairing the tower. Oh, well, not this door. Well, it would be safer for all of us. We. Oui. No need to bother him about it, though. He 
is quite busy at the moment. It's on your head if something goes wrong. All right. Just let me get back inside. Let's see here. Let's see what's going on in here. Hello. Float up. Whoosh! Hello and greetings. I was not dropped off at the rate of Z axis or Yeah, something like that. Y axis coordinate. Oh man. How am I supposed to get anything? You again. Didn't I see you in Raven Rock? Yeah, probably. You refer to the tomes of esoteric knowledge that old Hermaeus Mora has scattered throughout the world? Is this somehow connected to your search for Mira? I mean, yeah. I found one, I need to find more. Found one? Yes. And you read it too, didn't you? Don't try to deny it. You've got the look. I can see it now. Dangerous yeah, knowledge I... is still knowledge and therefore useful. Usually it turns out to be the most useful in my experience. Um. Uh, I have to know what Mirak knows if I want to stop him. That is a dangerous path indeed. Hermaeus Mora gives nothing away for free. You may end up like Mirak, of course. Two power mad dragonborn. It could be very interesting. Do you know where I can find another one? Oh, yes. They're not hard to locate once you know how to look for them. I have one here that I've been using to locate more. You have one? Yes, I haven't been idle while this fascinating madness engulfed Solstheim. But my book isn't what you're looking for. I'm quite sure it is unconnected with this Mirak. But I do know where to find a black book that can help you. Why won't the book you have here help oh, me? Oh, it is clearly not associated with the same power that has overtaken the island. And I'm not talking about Hermaeus Mora. These black books are all his, of course. No, what you're looking for is a specific book, presumably because Mirak's power derives from it. All right, so do you know where to find it then? Yes, I do. I haven't been able to get it, though. But maybe together we can unlock the secrets the Dwemer left behind. Just tell me where the book is and I'll go get I'm it. I'm afraid it isn't that simple. If it was, I would have the book already. It seems the ancient Dwemer discovered this book and took it to study. I found their reading room in the ruins of Nachardak. The book is there, but it's sealed in a protective case, which I wasn't able to open. But perhaps the two of us, together, will be able to get at the book. Oh. To Nachardak, then. Follow me. I have all that. I don't know. Let me show you. You want to take a look at your black book? That's quite a hit. Um, I know that sounds weird to say, you know, now that I've said it. But, um. Oh, there, but. I do wonder, though. No, okay. Oh, hello, welcome back. Did you fucking forget something? Oh, it's in there. I'm gonna use your black book. God damn it. Well, here we go. Whoosh! <laughs> it just won't drop me off in the right position, and I find that to be fucking hilarious. That might work. Fucking weirdo. Oh, okay. I love me. Oh, I remember this now. Yeah, I remember this. This is gonna be fun, yeah, yes. We're in for a real tree, huh?
Can we move a little bit faster here now, or... No? Alright, well, cool. I see moss. I got it. I got some moss. Are those the sounds of those dog things? God damn. Dog things. Wait. This one not evil? This one's not evil, look at that. From hey! The look on your face, I'm guessing you've never seen a silt strider before. Um, no, this what is it? It's dusty. I personally trained her from a lava. Feels like a lifetime ago now. She hasn't been in traveling condition for quite a while now. I'll try to let it go off on her own, but she insists on staying here. Fucking dog thing is hor horrific. We get bar trade nods and ends with the locals. I've decided to stay here and make sure she passes in peace. It's the least I can do for her. Every once in a while, a local makes it out here. Although they usually just want to catch a glimpse of Dusty. Silt striders are pretty rare now. What do you have for sale? Take a look. Where's the thing that I want? There it is. Bada bing, bada boom, we got it. Do you have anything else? Cool. Uh, not really. Alright. I see your deal here. Um. But I do have some shit to sell, so I can make up some money here quick. So I fuck it. Alright, thanks, mate. Safe travel. I do yes, actually sir. want to know more about them. What would you like to know? Why are they so rare? Lost from a volcano, what most of them out. Found dusty in a small cave on Vardenfell. So the start of cocoons are pretty tough. What are they used for? Mostly for transporting goods and people. They were pretty commonplace in Morrowind, but that was ages ago. A silk strider carapace is so strong, it can withstand the harshest of weather. Even the legendary sandstorms of Baldenfell's Molagama region were said to barely make a dent in them. Of course, that's all ash now. Enough about this. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I want to get a look at it. Fucking asshole. Oh, look at this big guy. He's fucking terrifying. Look at that, he has a little dent. Huh. These things are cool. I, I've seen a little bit of Morrowind and I distinctly remember these guys, so that's cool. God, you're fucking ugly. I'd kill you if I could. I'm not that much of a dick. Oh, hey, Nala. Thanks for waiting. Great if we could just go an ounce faster here, buddy. Like, I hate to be impatient, but... these weavers and people hanging out. I freed you, you know, you can go wherever you want. Don't have to stick around here and be useless or whatever. Alright, now that we could really, I mean, if we could pick up the pace, buddy. I love and respect you, but... Whoops. <laughs> Knocked out a cord here. I really would like to get this show on the road now, Beth. I 
I just went ahead. I don't give a fuck. Motherfucker can learn to move two inches faster. Well, we're here. So, we'll explore it next time on Sakura Plays. Thank you all for coming, and I love you guys. See you next time. Bye!